Hey everybody, Anne here, and today I want to talk about activated carbon or biochar. I went foraging for it, and you know what? It's got a ton of uses. Alright, I see a fire pit right up here. It looks like somebody had burnt a whole bunch of stuff, so I'm going to see if I can scavenge any biochar from this lovely looking fire circa. Oh yeah. Alright, the first thing that I see is this beautiful piece right here. Look at that. It's kind of shiny. Look at that. That's a keeper. I'm going to put it in my, my little bag. Sorry. There we go. And I keep my little ice bags because they're good strong bags. Now, look at this. Another good piece. Goes in the bag. Here's another piece. I can wash these off later. Also goes in the bag. Man, I hit the jackpot. Look at all these pieces of beautiful charcoal, biochar, whatever you want to call it. Lovely. Oh my goodness. Ha! I hit the jack. I hit the jack. I don't like that. Oh, that's good. I like that. This is good. This is good. Um. You know what? Don't put glass bottles in fire pits, seriously. Alright. That's a good piece. Um, good piece. Let's see. Uh, 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 uh. Yep. Let's see what else. Oh, there's a whole bunch. Check all this out. Check it out. Look at that. Look at that. Look at all this, you guys. There's an absolute ton of it. Oh my goodness. This is a water filter maker's dream. There's just too much. Now, I don't really need to make a water filter right now, but when I see stuff like this, there's no way, there's no way that I'm passing it up. No way. Look at that. Look at all that I got so far quite a bit. And there's quite a bit more too. Do I need to get all of it? I don't know. I mean, storing it might be a, a challenge. Um, yeah, I think that's good enough for now. I don't know. I'm tempted just to pick up all of it here. Let me, let me get this piece right here. That's a good piece. Oh, and it sounds like it's clinky. I like the clinky sounding biochar. I don't know how I'm filming this. I don't know if it's any good, but uh, yeah, I think that's it. I think that's all I'm gonna get for from this fire pit. Let's see if we can find more. And here are a few things that you can use activated carbon or biochar for. In soil for water and nutrient retention. It can be used as an energy source for cooking and heating. Biogas production, moonshiners use it to filter shine, and apparently it can also be used for insulation. Not sure how, I'm going to have to Google that. In the medical industry, it's used for detoxification, and my personal favorite, for water and air purification. So yeah, you can use it for a ton of different stuff, and as I learn how to use each different application, I'll maybe make a video, I don't know, we'll see. But uh, it's easy to make. All you gotta do is burn some wood and then throw some water on it. There you go. So if any of you out there know of other uses for biochar, or basically the product of burning wood, um, activated charcoal, whatever, um, leave your comments below. I would love to hear your thoughts on this and I enjoy learning new things. And so yeah, just let me know what you think. Thanks for watching everybody. I hope you enjoyed the video. Make sure you like, subscribe, hit the bell, and y'all have a good one.